what shall I say unto my father? It's all I have to say is thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. See, all I have to say is thank you for the breath in my lungs. My body, I thank you. You're a wonderful father to me. From the depths of my heart, all I have to say, I thank you. Happy Sunday to you all, wherever on the Atlas you are watching OITV Channel 23, broadcasting harm of Omo Ileri International Resources. Company Limited. Welcome to the Gospel Outreach Ministry for another wonderful Sunday's ministration from the anointed man of God, full of grace and oracle of the Most High God, His Eminence Julius Olainka Osayade Habe. Stay tuned, go nowhere, and receive your blessing in Jesus' name. Amen. I have seen the Lord's goodness, His mercies and compassion. I have seen the Lord's goodness. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. I have seen the Lord's goodness, His mercies and compassion. I have seen the Lord's goodness. Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Oh Lord, you have been so good. You are so good to me. Oh Lord, you are excellent in my life every day. Oh Lord, you have been so good. You are so good to me. Oh Lord, you are excellent in my life. Hallelujah. Indeed, the Lord is so good. He has shown us goodness and mercy and compassion for bringing us to the beginning of another month. This is the month of December. Hallelujah! That we are all spared to see this beautiful month of December, year 2021. Glory, honor, adoration be to the name of our Lord Jesus Christ in the name of Jesus. We bless the name of God for His gift of life upon us. We bless the name of God Almighty for strengthening us, for giving us good health, for preserving our lives. We pray that Almighty His name be praised forever in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Today we are looking at the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 3. And we're going to read from verse 11 to verse 15. Ecclesiastes chapter 3 from verse 11 to verse 15. He has made everything appropriate in his time. He has also put eternity in their hearts. But man cannot discover the work God has done from the beginning to the end. I know that there is nothing better for them than to rejoice and enjoy the good life. It is also the gift of God. Whenever anyone eats, drinks, and enjoys all his efforts, I know that all God does will last forever. There is no adding to it or taking from it. God works so that people will be in awe of him. Whatever it is, has already been, and whatever will be, already is. God repeats what has passed. Hallelujah. The title of this message today is God's Works Are Perfect. God's Works Are Perfect. We serve a living God whose ways are perfect, whose works are perfect. Everything about Him is perfect perfect. His deeds are perfect. So also his timing, the timing of his actions are also very, very perfect. Whatever God does is perfect. The Bible says he has done everything appropriate in its time. He has made everything appropriate 
in his time. There is no mistake about anything that God does. He is a perfect God. The Bible makes us to understand in Revelation chapter 1, verse 8, that he is the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. He was, he is, and he is to come. That is God for you. Time or space has no meaning to him at all. He is not, he is not, he is not uh, uh, measured by time. He is not anything that has to do with time. No. God is perfect. He was, he is, and he is to come. He, he, he occupies the entire space that you cannot regulate him by time. And whatever he does is perfect. Sometimes when God does certain things to us, we feel, oh, this thing is rather delayed or it's not meeting with the time. That's our own understanding. But to God, that is the perfect time that he wants to do it. He is doing it to glorify his name because our thoughts differ completely from his it's not the way we think that God thinks. He thinks in another way entirely. So our expectations may be high at times. I will say, oh, this must happen, that must happen to God. Maybe, no, I'm yet to start with you. My time is my time. And God's time, as we always say, is the best. Is the best. So, these works are very, very perfect. So where we think we have come to the dead end might be the time that God seems to be beginning or just starting with us. So we cannot compare our own timing with that of His. This is December. Hallelujah. We are already in December. Some people might be thinking, oh, the year is gone. The year is gone. This is the last month of the, of the year. I have labored. I have done so many things. I have toiled so much. And for 11 months, I have not really made something tangible or something I can be grateful for. Oh, brothers, sisters, you have to be grateful for little, little messages that you have received from God. You have to show gratitude to Him for all that He has done for you. And don't give up. You don't have to give up because you are serving a perfect God. Don't say, this is December, there isn't much time for me to do much again or to do anything again. You have toiled, you have labored so much, it doesn't really matter. But I want to tell you, and I'm speaking as the oracle of God into your life today, that this month of December will be the month that God's glory will manifest in your life. This month of December will be the month that your good result will manifest. Everything that you have labored for will come forth. God will glorify himself in your life. All your toys, all your labors will be fruitful in the mighty name of Jesus. If you have that trust in God, that he is perfect. He does not make mistakes. And He loves you. God loves you. If you have that belief in you, you will not be disappointed. I want to tell you something, that you are going to catch many people by surprise. The Lord is going to surprise you. He's going to do marvelous things in your life. Your performance in these few days remaining in the year will date so many other people. It's going to daze them. Many people that have gone far, far, far ahead of you, you are going to overtake them in the mighty name of Jesus. Because you are serving a living God, you are serving a perfect God, a God that does not make mistakes. He loves you. He loves you. He's the one that has preserved your life even throughout these 11 months. He's the one that has been keeping you in all your outings, in all your activities throughout the, month, throughout the 11 months of the year. And because you have been faithful to him, 
this is the time is going to pay you back for your faithfulness. This 12th month, this 12th month will be a fruitful month for you. We have designed this, God has designed this month to be our month of divine fulfillment. Divine fulfillment. Throughout this month, God is going to fulfill all the promises that he has made concerning our lives. So, brothers and sisters in the Lord, I am assuring you, you will not be disappointed. This month, your labors shall be fruitful. This month, your performances shall daze many people. This month, you are going to catch many by surprise in the mighty name of Jesus. And you are going to overtake those who have gone ahead of you. Your song this month shall be glorious in the name of Jesus. By the time this month shall be coming to an end, the songs that, you, that shall be on your lips will be, He has done for me, He has done for me. He has done it again. He has done for what my parents cannot do. He has done for what my fathers cannot do. He has done for what my neighbors cannot do. He has done for me. He has done it again. He has done for me. He has done it again. He has done for me. What my parents cannot do. He has done for me. What my children cannot do. He has done for me. What my neighbors cannot do. He has done for me. So shall it be for every one of us in the mighty name of Jesus. So I thank God that he has blessed us so much and brought us to this 12th month of December. You are going to experience divine fulfillment in every area of your life in the mighty name of Jesus. So shall it be in the name of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. I am, by His grace, His Eminence, Julius O.O. Abbey of the African Church. God bless you. Welcome back. We are debtors to every man to give him the gospel as we have received it. Subscribe to OI TV channel, Omo Ileri TV channel, for positive, educative, scintillating programs and life transforming ministration. Join us same time next Sunday for another wonderful ministration, so winning and life transforming. Till next week Sunday, stay blessed and keep watching OITV Channel 23. God bless you. Bye for now. Olu ako no ba no wo. Eh, eh, yon no no mo ferro yi ni bi bo bo te ti mo me la koko yi. Ile she yi OITV omo ileri mo fe ki agbiyan ju lati ma wo ni ore kore ke ma wo mu to nti be jade nitori pe iwe owe ori keta ise kesan oni fi ohun ini re bowo fun olorun eni pe akoko yi awon eni won yi won ran se olorun lowo lati gbolowo irere lati ran awon ode olowo o nto le se ninu eni pe ma wo ba ti won na ba wo igba agbara tabi ipa tolorun ba wa fi fun won nitori pe olorun fun ara re ma nfe oni ni dudun olore lakoko ya ti lojo waju agbara tori ofe to fi ma se olorun ma fi fun won temi ni pe ma subscribe ni gbogbo igba lati le ma wo ko ma wo oro ijile ko ma wo awon ohun igbala ati awon to le mu okun bale ti o ma fara won ni ise yi mo so ni ba ile ise o i t v omo ileri loruko jesu ileri ojo pipe yo se ninu aye re igbala ni tolorun because for talent show um, we promise you it's going to be you know a rewarding uplifting interesting energizing and i hope to become a celebrity very soon registration start first of december 2021 and the registration is done online just showcase tell us what you can do if you can sing sing from your heart if you can drum drum from your heart if you can play the keyboard do it from your heart. The, the, the the flute the trumpet anything you can do we just need you to do it under under a minute and you send it um to the to the link the link will be given to you below 
um, um, below the TV, the TV screen, you'll see it there. There are a lot of prizes to be won. You know, we have the first prize of 250,000 Naira. We have the second prize of 150,000 Naira. And we have the top prize of 100,000 Naira. Uh, I hope to see you very soon, to see all your videos, and I wish you the best of luck. So, always remember that your talent is a divine gift from God.